What is going on everybody? This is Drydox here bringing you a pretty informative video. I know a lot of my videos were very like jokingishly videos and whatever. You kind of laugh at them and whatnot. But in this video, we are going to be a little bit more serious and talk about some stuff that could possibly help you out in your future of playing Lords Mobile. So, that being said, hope you all enjoyed the video. If y'all do, leave a like and subscribe for more videos. Turn those notifications on and let's get to the video. So, in this video, we are going to be talking about your research, speed ups. The, the main concept of this video is us talking about uh, speed ups, okay? Using your speed ups wisely. Now, a lot of y'all and a lot of actually a lot of people, including myself, make the mistakes on uh, how to use gems, how to use speed ups, all the other good stuff, right? So I'm gonna try to like break it down for y'all. Hopefully, y'all understand where I'm where I'm coming from. And um, again, my idea, my concept of things, the way I see things, is not always correct. But the way that I, the way that I feel, the way that I'm about to explain things to you, I feel like this is like the best way to do things, okay? So, so first of all, let's talk about when and how to use your speed ups, okay? So for one, you go over to your inventory, you have your speed ups right here. You have your regular speed ups, okay? And then you have like, okay, hold on a second. You have your, like your green speed ups, three minutes, all the way to like one hour. And then you have these blue speed ups, which are like three hours, eight hours. And then you also have your research speed ups, okay? Same exact thing, right? Green and blue, so on and so forth. So, a lot of people will make the mistakes of speeding up your uh, your construction speed, right? They'll go over here and they'll go to construction. Oh my god, 12 hours left. Let me go ahead, speed this up real quick, man. I can, I can use 12 of these and I can get this construction done. Hell of a lot faster than if I just waited, wait it, bro, you know, know what I mean? mean? No, do not do that. God, I'm here to tell y'all. Once you get higher in my, for instance, I'm 41 million might, okay? A lot of that has to do with my, I'm going to show y'all, my, my research, right? Okay, here's my, my research is at 13, I, I have 13 million core might just from research, right? Um, I think my overall core might is like 30 something mil or something like that, right? But, um, a lot of that has to do with research, okay? So, this is where the speed ups will come in. Save those re save save those speed ups for your research because you're gonna have to get T4s and in order to get T4s guys you're gonna need to max out everything on your military okay your military has got to be 10 of 10 on everything as well as your economy has to be 10 of 10 as well I mean look at my economy I'm not even close right um, that's because I'm working on my military because I'm more of an attack guy I like to attack <clears throat> and guys like I said. People have different ways of playing the game, and I've made my mistakes at the very beginning of the game. Um, I use a lot of gems, guys. A lot. Like, I've spent some money on this game, and I spent a lot of money on this game when I first started, okay? And I used a lot of gems, <coughs> gemming troops, T3 troops to be exact. I had over one, I had like one point something million T3 troops at one point, okay? And I was like at like 30 something million might or something like that, right? Guys, look how many troops I have now. Okay, this is not from getting attacked. You know why? Because look, my infirmaries, I can hold 357k infirmaries, okay? Um, I, I know how to show through my troops, I know how to send them to shielded castles, all that good stuff. So I have not lost troops, like dead troops from attacking people. I have lost troops from uh, or for pe I haven't had lost troops from people attacking me. Um, I've lost troops from attacking people. As you can tell, I have 38 million kills. Okay, and a lot of a lot, a lot of this had to do with at the beginning of the game. I did not know how to attack. I didn't, you know, how to. I didn't know how to do all that stuff. Right, I was still new to the game. I thought I did, but I didn't. So I use a lot of gems to gem my troops. That is a no no. Do not do that. I know it's very tempting. It is extremely tempting to do so, guys. I know, I know, trust me, I was there. But you have to trust me at this. Save those gems, guys, for your research military. Or even if you even not even not. Don't even don't use your gems yet on your on your research, right? Save your gems because you have to get 200k gems on your prison, on your what is your embassy? on your battle hall and on your altar 200k each so that's 600k gems each bro for each of those special abilities so you gotta save those gems for that as well as 
once you max those out, guys, then you're gonna need T4s. Then you can start gymming T4 troops. That is when you want to start gymming your troops. That's like the only time you want to gym troops. Do not gym tr troops when you have like T3s and T2s, things like that. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Um, you want to gym those troops when you have your T4s, guys. So save those gems for your special buildings, prison, altar, battle hall, okay? Now, talk about your speed ups. Use your speed ups on your research. Freaking use them on your research to speed that up. Look at here where I'm at. Researching 15 days remaining on our research, okay? So here we go. I'm about to use my speed ups on my research. Because again, research is crucial. Go ahead, start your military research and your economy research. Go ahead and start that right now. Don't worry about anything else. Focus on that because those will lead you to T4s. So I'm going to go ahead and use my um, speed ups that I have. One day, 15 hours taken off. Watch my time up here, right? I'm at 15 days. Use it, drops down to 13 days, okay? Go ahead and use these. I'm gonna keep on using three days taken off. Look at that, I was at 16, That's I'm already at 10 days, right? Oh my gosh, bro. Go ahead, use, use speed ups, gotta keep using them. Gotta keep using them. All of them, bro. Every single one of them will go straight towards my research, bro. Like seriously, look at this. Guys, I was at 17 days. Look where I'm at now, five days. This is research, it is a very, very freaking crucial. Extremely crucial. I know a lot of you guys are going to want to like speed your castle of 25. What I can tell you about this, those of y'all who want castle 25, yes, it is very nice. Um, I can go ahead and let y'all know. For me, again, myself, me personally, I went ahead and got my castle of 25 as soon as possible, right? I know you're supposed to be like balanced and get all your other buildings like around the same level and whatnot. But guys, what I did was, I just started, I got, I was like at level 20 castle, and then you need like your, you need your workshop, and then some other stuff to level up, and then you can level your castle 21, so I did that. Once you level castle 21, it repeats itself. You gotta level your, your workshop again, and then some like your, your, uh, your quarry, and then all that stuff before you can go to castle level 22, so on and so forth. Okay, I just went around the circle, kept doing it, kept upgrading all those buildings until my castle got to 25, okay? I didn't worry about... Keeping all these levels like at say like 20. I didn't let I didn't level like all these up. I didn't get like 20, 20, 20, 20, 20 across. You know what I mean? I went ahead and got this to 25. For one, because you get the extra, you get five uh, sets of troops that you can send out, and that's more resources that you can gather with, right? And I also did a lot of attacking, right? And I like to attack with five sets of troops. So that's the reason why I like the Castle 25, and plus it looks cool, right? So I went ahead and got this to level 25 like as soon as possible. Um, and then I started really focusing, using all my speed ups and everything else on my uh, military research, right? And um, again, I'm trying to help every one of y'all out who, who are new to the game. Focus on your military and your economy, man. Just literally get that up. Get those T4s, bro. I've been playing this game since the game came out, man. Look where I'm at, okay? Like, I'm pretty far up here in my military. It's, all, it's not quite there, but, you know, it's kind of there, you know what I mean? So... Get this up. It's, it's going to help, help out a lot. It's, it's going to help you out in your defense, and it's also going to help you out in attacking people as well if you're into that. Um, but again, use those speed ups on your research. Do not gym troops. Do not gym T3, T2 troops. It's not worth it at all. Like, literally, it's not worth it. You want to gym troops when you get to T4s. When you get to T4s, gym all the T4 troops you want, right? Gym all the T3 troops you want. But save those gems for your special buildings, like your altar, your prison, your battle hall, because it costs 200k gems each to level those up, man. So again, I want to get this little video out here to try to uh, try to help y'all out as much as I can. Um, but yeah, guys, this is going to do it for this uh, little speed up, informative type of video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Let me know if you like these kind of videos. I know I do a lot of entertaining type of videos as well. That's what I'm more leaned towards on the in the YouTube community. I want to be like the entertainer. You know what I mean? So, um, anyways, let me know what y'all think. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I hope y'all learned something from it. If y'all did, leave a like and subscribe as always. I love you guys. Y'all are freaking amazing. I swear. Freaking Strive Fan for Life. Hashtag PAP. I will see y'all later, guys. Thank y'all so much for watching. Peace.